coming off of a conference championship loss, our birds take on Jake and the Buccaneers to open up the season. So without further ado, let's get into it. Early in the game, Ezekiel Elliott cutting it back and he'll run it all the way to the 40 five yard line on a nice run there later now Derek Carr finding a wide open Saeed Blacknail on a coverage breakdown and 7-0 the Eagles take an early lead later now looking on third down and a big throw there from Stafford for a first down move the chains another third down though for Stafford and this time Khalil Mack gets home brings him down and forces a punt later now Derek Carr on third and seven firing one in they'll find Kelsey for a nice first down there. Later now, another big play. Carr back looking and he'll fire this one in and that's Travis Kelsey again to the 19 yard line for the Eagles. Later now, they use Ezekiel Elliott for a big run touchdown and the Eagles take a quick 14-0 lead. Later now, another third down and another big sack for Khalil Mack as he gets him there. Oh, sorry, the second down and now third down. Looking down the field, a bomb and what a catch. Huge play there for the Buccaneers to get it down there. Now third and goal, Stafford back. Looking under pressure, just throw it away and the Buccaneers take their three points. Now looking still right before half, Carr fires underneath and again it's Travis Kelsey for a nice first down. Later now, Carr throwing it and yet again, Kelsey is just a monster this game. Third and 10 now, they look for Thielen and he can't quite hold on, but the Eagles will get three and go up 17, the three before half. Now, Christian McCaffrey finally getting some open space on the toss, running and ooh, what a move on the run stick there from Jake, a huge touchdown there as they cut the lead down to seven. Later now, Carr back, looking down the field, fires one in and there it is. This time, Thielen will hold in for a first down. Later now, second down, firing one in, and it's again Kelsey getting it to the 11-yard line there. Now later, third and goal. Carr looking fine and dealing, but incomplete. They will have to settle for a field goal, 20 to 10 the score. Later now, Matthew Stafford back looking, and a fire one in, complete. On a third down, that forces a punt. Later now, third and fourth for the Eagles, and they go to Zeke, and that's incomplete. Forcing a punt back to the Buccaneers. Later now, Stafford looking down the field, but he'll throw it underneath on third down. That'll get it to a fourth and four now. With time running down, they'll have to go for it. And Stafford firing underneath to McCaffrey, but a missed tackle and a huge first down there for the Bucks. Later now, as they continue to drive down the field, throwing one up, and this time it's Jordan Nass, the linebacker, with a huge interception and a nice run back, getting it to the 30-yard line there. The Eagles now get the ball. But again, they stall to a third down, throwing one up to new acquiree Marcus Goodwin, and nothing doing there. They have to punt it back to the Buccaneers. Later now, Stafford looking, throwing one up down the field. Incomplete, but that'll be a huge penalty there for a first down. Now, later, Stafford looking for a screen, but he fires one all the way down the field. What a play there. Touchdown. And now an onside kick. Who will recover? The Eagles get on it, but can they finally get this one out? Third down, they try to run it, not getting it to go there. And now to punt it back to the Buccaneers. Last play now, 10 seconds left. Stafford looking and he fires it complete, but wrapped up down they go. The Eagles will end up escaping with a 20 to 17 win in week one. Next up, they will play the Giants in week two. So let's see what happens. Thank you. 